lot of people think that the lifestyle is we're all a bunch of freaks that just get naked and jump on each other. No, that's, that's not what happens at all. You know, when you walk into a club, first thing you have to do is the initial walk in is get naked and throw you in the pile. No, that's, <laughs> no, that's not what happens. You know, and just come on in and, and everybody lets their inhibitions down. There's just sexual energy in a swinger club that you don't get anywhere else. And it's almost a calming effect with people. I mean, people in the lifestyle, we all understand it. We go in, and it's a camaraderie amongst a bunch of people that we can relate to sexually. Tamika, they didn't throw you in the pile? Uh, did you get naked? Um, actually, they tried to. <laughs> it took me a while, you know, because when I, um, I had some experience before, but I've never been into a club where it freaked me out. I was like, oh my God, I was actually scared. And my baby had to say, okay, baby, just loosen up. We're here, you know. And I used to come in with jeans and heels and shirt on. And I was like, oh my God, I can't believe it's something like this. But as I sat down and I got to know people, I was like, it is some really intelligent, nice, smart, you know, people around. And they're very honest. So after a year, for his birthday, I decided to reveal, you know, spice it up a little bit. And after that, I've been spicing it up ever since. But <laughs> my friends used to say, girl, you need to get them clothes off. You got on too much clothes. And I'm like, I'm not ready, you know, not yet, because, you know, I'm still in that mama mode and all this. <laughs> I'm not ready. But, you know, it's very comfortable now. Once I get to know, got to know everybody and got to see how the club was and how respectful it is and how respectful the people are here and how safe it was, then I was able to let myself go.